When you think of a giant ground sloth, you probably picture the massive megatherium, leisurely munching on leaves in the warm, lush forests of prehistoric South America. It's an iconic image of the Ice Age. But what if I told you that a different, equally impressive branch of this family decided to go north? Way north. Todefrosin. Windswept tundras of Alaska. Imagine a creature that makes even the largest bison look small. Now, wrap it in a magnificent, thick coat of shaggy fur, a natural parka designed to withstand the brutal Arctic cold. This was the Alaskan ground sloth, a true pioneer of the north. Unlike its southern relatives who enjoyed a tropical buffet, this giant had to survive on the tough, resilient shrubs that clung to life in the frozen soil. It was a master of adapting to one of the harshest environments on Earth. Let's paint a picture. The world is locked in ice. Basque, barren landscapes stretch as far as the eye can see during the long, dark winters. This colossal animal would move slowly across the tundra, its huge claws digging into the permafrost for traction. It wasn't just surviving. It was living under one of the most spectacular sights our planet has to offer. Picture this giant peacefully grazing under the ethereal, dancing green and purple lights of the Aurora Bor the northern lights shimmering across its massive, furry back. It's a breathtaking scene, a testament to the incredible resilience and adaptability of life. The Alaskan ground sloth wasn't just an animal. It was a symbol of strength in a world of ice and stone. Its story reminds us that life finds a way to thrive in the most unexpected and challenging places. From the warm tropics to the frozen Arctic, the story of the ground sloth is far more diverse and fascinating than we ever imagined. Thanks for joining me on this journey back in time. If you enjoyed this glimpse into the prehistoric north, do you unforget to hit that like button and subscribe for more amazing stories from our planet's past. See you next time.